Well, you get to the Elite Eight, you're Wisconsin, the state celebrities are going to come out, like Aaron Rodgers, for instance, the Packers quarterback, savoring the big win over Baylor with head coach Bo Ryan. Hello, everybody. I'm Ray Crawford. For the fourth time in school history, the Badgers have advanced to the Elite Eight. Phil Dawson is our Wisconsin insider, and he joins us after witnessing the 17-point win. And, Phil, how were they able to make it look so easy? Yeah, really on the defensive end, Ray, they stopped this Baylor team that scored 40 in the first half, 45 in the second half against Creighton. Well, they held them just three field goals in the first half of the first half. The first 10 minutes, it took Baylor to get really anything going offensively, and they didn't. 20% in that first half shooting, started on the defense, and then just surgical through that 1-3-1 zone as the Badgers just continued to roll all game long. So Bo Ryan, as we know, he took Wisconsin to the Elite Eight in 2005. That's as far as it got. So now they are, here they are in 2014. Is this the right team? Is this the right coach to make that next step to get to the Final Four? Well, yeah, you would think so. This is a guy who's had success, really. I mean, he has four national championships at the Division Three level. And like you said, they've won Big Ten titles. They've gone to the NCAA tournament every year that he's been here. But again, this is just the second Elite Eight. Now, they're good enough offensively. They're one of the most efficient offenses in the nation. Depending on what their defense can do, that's what will get them over the top this year, in my opinion, because the offense will be there for them. But can they lock down some of the high and elite scorers uh, that they'll face now in the in potential last two games. Well, it's very possible Michigan and Michigan State could join Wisconsin, putting three Big Ten teams in the Elite Eight. What do you see in these teams here that have made them so successful here in the NCAA tournament? we got to start again with the offensive efficiency, and all these teams can hit threes. Michigan may be relying on it more so, but because they can, they can go to the well with a Nick Stauskas. Michigan State actually led the Big Ten in three-point field goal percentage this year. And you have guys like Josh Gosser and Ben Bruss. Those were two individuals who were at the top of the Big Ten charts in terms of three-point shooting. And then everything that goes along with it that complements them. You know how good Adrian Payne is, Dawson, the rest of Michigan State. And Wisconsin has proven again with five players that can get double figures for you. They're just all dangerous offensively, and if their defenses are there, they can win championships. Great time of year to be playing their best basketball. Phil Dawson, thanks as always. And don't forget, we preview the Elite Eight matchups as they materialize. Check out Who's Got Next only on CampusInsiders.com.